back to my channel. I hope you guys are staying safe and well. want to wish you guys a safe and happy and prosperous new year when it comes. Today is Meatless Thursday and I'm going to make spaghetti squash with broccoli stir fry. To my broccoli, I'm going to add some sweet pepper, onion, garlic, and some portobello mushrooms. I'm going to use grapeseed oil to saute my vegetables. I'm going to add a little bit of teriyaki sauce. Also, I have here red pepper flakes, garlic powder, onion powder, adobo, black pepper, and some sesame seeds. Stay tuned, guys. Cut it open. You want to remove the seeds. I'm going to um, throw these in my garden. So basically, you take a spoon and you try to scrape out the pulps. So basically, I'm going to Put some olive oil on it, inside and out, and just gonna rub it nicely. I'm also gonna put some salt and pepper. Just a little black pepper like that and I'm gonna put it on there. I have my oven preheat to 400 degrees a little olive oil on the outside as well. And I wash my squash before all this. And you just put it the open side, you put that down. Just like that. I'm going to put this in the oven for 40 minutes. Okay, guys? Stay. So I'm just going to leave it in there for 40 minutes, guys. And it's been 40 minutes, and I just removed the uh, spaghetti squash from my oven. So I already turned one over. Let's turn this one over. See, look at that. Yummy. So I'm just going to let this cool off a bit, okay? Stay tuned. I have two tablespoons of grape seed oil in here and I'm going to add my garlic to it. I'm using minced garlic. My stove is on low heat and I'm going to just let this cook a little bit before I add my onions. Oh guys, I just love the smell of garlic. So I'm just letting um, the garlic saute in the oil a little bit. 
for like a minute or so. My stove is on low heat. And now I'm going to add my onion. And I'm going to let this caramelize for about two to three minutes before I add the rest of my vegetables. Stay tuned, guys. Okay, guys, so it's been going for three minutes now. Onions are nice and caramelized. And now I'm going to add my peppers. So I'm going to add my mushroom. Okay, so pretty that way. Mushrooms are a really good meat substitute. I mean, being born and raised in Jamaica, I've never eaten are like mushrooms but once I try them I really love them Just gonna let this um, sit for a couple minutes before I add my broccoli because I don't like my broccoli to be like very soft. Looks so yummy. Look at this, it's so nice, right? Smells good too. Now I'm going to add the broccoli. And I'm going to season them. Now I'm going to season, season my pot. A little sprinkle of salt. Some red pepper flakes. Uh, garlic powder, of course. And some onion powder. sprinkle of adobo and some black pepper. I'm gonna put my teriyaki sauce into it. I'm just gonna stir it up. Hey guys. My broccoli stir fry. Looking so yummy, guys, and it smells so good too. You can cook your broccoli to your liking, but I like my broccoli to have a little crunch to it. Squash is nice and cool. So basically, you just take a fork and you just do like this. See? Looks just like spaghetti. How oh, yummy. See, that's it. Put it on the plate. Yummy. Smells good too. This is a good weight loss option. Alright, so let's 
make a plate. I love broccoli. Get a little juice. Okay. So yummy. So this is it guys. My spaghetti squash. The broccoli stir fry. So I hope you guys will this recipe you try. And until next time, be kind to others. One love.